Hi guys, I'm JimonoJets215, finally bringing you this very special unboxing of a plane that is pretty much sold out worldwide. Now, most of you know which plane this is, and um, if you follow me on Facebook, then you would know that this plane has been delayed for around three months, and this is on the February releases, so it's kind of been uh, around for a while. But, I mean, it hasn't really been, I guess, Phoenix was making more, or I don't know, but this plane has been delayed for three months, and they were all released to their um, international distributors all around the world, and they finally shipped, and I just got mine yesterday, which was the 12th. And, uh, well, let's start. So, it is the Phoenix Models Boeing 777-300ER for the Air New Zealand All Blacks. Now, the registration of this plane is ZK-OKQ. It is a 1-400 scale platinum series. If we take a look on the back, it, it says limited edition, All Blacks. Air New Zealand, the heart of aviation. This product is licensed uh, under Boeing, you know, the management. And then we have the Boeing symbol, officially licensed product. And then we have the uh, barcode, too. So, and the Air New Zealand symbol. And I believe this is for the, uh, the football or soccer team. Or, no, 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 no. It's the rugby team in Auckland, New Zealand. So, uh... I know I kind of got confused with the uh, Manchester club, but this is the rugby um, team that's the big one in New Zealand. So Phoenix, or not Phoenix, I mean in New Zealand painted, I believe, an A320 and then also obviously the 777-300ER in these special colors and the All Blacks colors, and that's why this plane is out now. So it says All Blacks here too, and then on the bottom we see the Phoenix logo in New Zealand, the plane, the model, the uh, the type of aircraft, registration, all blacks, um, in New Zealand, and Phoenix, and then it's pretty much, but on this side it's white actually, so, uh, and then it kind of like fades away like, yeah, but let's start. So I got this yesterday, which was May 12th. And, uh, yeah, I mean, I was pretty excited. It came on FedEx, so, uh, just throwing it out there. And, uh, something else that's special is that my brother got it for me for my birthday, so this video is dedicated to him, and, uh, I have to say thank you for such an amazing model, so, uh, let's get started. And also, today, uh, for the tennis fans out there, it was the final of the Mutual Madrid Open in Madrid, and uh, Serena Williams knocked off um, Victoria Azarenka in straight sets at 6-1 and 6-3. And then Roger Federer beat Tomas Burdick 3-6, um, 7-5, 7-5. Seven, seven, so, and he's back to the number two ranking, so uh, knocking Nadal to the third place. But just a little history of today. Not really history, but what happened in the tennis world recently. Which is now played on blue clay, but now Djokovic and Nadal are all mad about it. So, we'll see what happens. And they said that they're not playing next year if it stays like this. But, anyway, back to Air New Zealand. So, this plane is an amazing, amazing plane. Um, overall, it's just, you know, it's not really a boring plane, but it just has so many details that can't make it boring, you know? So, uh, let's start in the front. Um, my camera doesn't focus, so I'm just gonna have to try to look hard. Um, right here is the cockpit, Air New Zealand, the two doors, um, Star Alliance symbol right there. I'm getting a new camera soon, so I'm gonna be able to, uh, make these videos in better quality, so... And then if we go towards the tail, we have the Air New Zealand um, tail, or I should say, or the symbol or the logo of them. And then right here, I think they're leaves. That's what I would assume that they are. They're leaves that uh, 
represent something from the rugby team. And uh, we go to the back, the stabilizers, we look at from the back. And then under, the leaves continue all around. But towards the front of the fuselage, you don't really see it. But uh, let's put it down like this. We see the registration is right here on the wing. The landing gear, of course, it is a rolling model, as all Phoenix models have rolling gears. And uh, towards the back, we see the bottom of the tail. And so that's pretty much it. I mean, it's an amazing model. So, uh, yeah. And if we see, if we take a little look right over there, next to Lufthansa A34600, that's where I'm going to be putting my in New Zealand. Okay, let's put the thing there. And, uh, put it a little closer. Let's put it at the gate. Perfectly. It has a double because it is a pretty big plane, so, you know, it needs a good amount of time to get the passengers off. So, uh, let's move that a little more. That's pretty much it. A good amount of space between the Lufthansa. So, uh, I mean, that's it. I mean, I took the double jetway off of the Manchester United plane so I could get it from this one and put it on this one. So, I mean... I'm really glad that I got it, so, uh, that's pretty much it, so, please comment, rate, subscribe, check back, and, uh, leave any comments, um, pretty much anything, just telling me how I'm doing, and, uh, what you like about the video, and what you like about Air New Zealand, and what do you like about all my videos, so, please take the time to do that, and I'm gonna go, so, see ya.